Greetings, comrades! This is Overgiven Caleb with another Doom video, and uh, you can see it right here. We are playing Pac Man Doom. And, uh, okay, I need to mute that. It, it just loops that Pac Man start music there. But, yeah, I saw Dragger K. Again, I'll link his uh, channel in the description below. He does a lot of Doom videos. Definitely so check him out. And, uh,. <laughs> One of his recent videos was this, and I figured, uh, you know what? Let's give it a try, you know? <laughs> no, something a little goofy, I guess. And, uh, funny thing, this... This mod actually came out yesterday, as of this clip's recording. And what was also interesting yesterday was my... One of my nephew's graduation ceremonies. <laughs> yes, he graduated, not with honors, but he did graduate from high school, and, uh... Yeah, I'm proud of them. Got some Rudies, and, uh, of course, had a little, uh, celebration cake. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, Pac-Man Doom. <laughs> you know, all these years of playing Doom, I never thought I'd see a mod like this. But, here we are. <laughs> and I played quite a few weird mods. I played Gardevoir as a gun. I played Grand Theft Auto Doom. I played GZ Shmup, which actually turns... Doom to a shoot him up. I played the Taylor Girl. Come on now. Which I'll probably do a video of that later on. I just never got around to it. Because I have played the Taylor Girl before. It's it's pretty interesting. But anyway. Yep. Pac-Man Doom. Unlimited quarters, Junior Pac-Man, bring on the ghosts. I don't need power products and Billy Mitchell. Yeah. Let's go with Junior Pac-Man. Okay. <laughs> Let's play some music here. I don't know if this is from any, any of the Pac-Man games, but okay. The four pack dots to insert a coin. <clears throat> okay. It's a lot of power on top of a giant arcade machine. Let me turn on the music a little bit. It's a little loud. Turn on the master volume a bit too. <coughs> and yeah. If you play Pac-Man, you you pretty much have a good grasp of what this mod's about. I like how the uh contrast is a little higher in the parts. Bells give you a hundred armor. Okay, it's not quite Pac-Man Arena yet. So... Strawberries are good for your armor. I'm sure they are. Okay, we got... The Skull Keys are actually Ghost Keys, okay. These are the keys. <coughs> oh shit. <laughs> Uh-oh. Okay, I need one more dot somewhere here. But yeah, Pac-Man, Doom. Not a common intro I imagine seeing, but here we are. There you are. Bananas are good for your health. Yeah, as long as you don't get too much potassium in your system. Remember, too much of a good thing can be bad. I do like the Chip 2 music, it's pretty cool. Yeah, I don't think it's from uh, any of the Pac-Man games. Try to make it punch real hard. Okay, so it's... Watch out, these are the four ghosts. Okay, Pinkies. Well, I guess uh, I'm going to assume they have actual names. <coughs> well, it's not like a... Uh... Yeah, it's not like the actual Pac-Man where if they touch you, you instantly die. You have a fighting chance. You might see these in the upcoming maps. Orange gives you 200 health to an armor. Blueberries give you 100 health, so Soul Spheres, Mega Spheres. Melons make you invulnerable, okay. I wonder what this does. Oh, 200 armor, okay. I thought it makes you invisible. Use the Orchid Machine to end the level. 
Cause she had lots of fun with the maps. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Crashing Clyde's castle. Okay, so it's sort of, kind of, sort of a uh, pack manager in terms of design. I like I saw the berserk. So, just out of curiosity, are any of the weapons different? No, gotta have that. Uh, I like how the gloves are like not red. Okay, yeah, weapons are pretty much the same. It's just instead Pac-Man's wielding them. <coughs> so basically to progress to the level, you have to collect pack dots Each door requires a certain number of pack dots I guess. So far I only have two. Okay, I heard a zombie. Need 20 for this one. Nice super shoddy. You know, I thought I'd play a little more like, uh. At least layout wise, I was hoping it looked a little more like Pac Man. But I saw a few videos of it, and it do exist like proper, like, uh. Pac Man maze maps. Maybe I need to play through it a little more. Because, first time playing this, so I'm going through it blind. I will say, though, it's a pretty interesting concept for a Doom mod. Again, Pac-Man and Doom. You know, Pac-Man, not the first thing that comes to mind when I think of Doom mods, but... Someone pulled it off. Doesn't look too bad. I do like the design of the map here, as simple as it is. I mean, it is a maze, you know. That's what Pac-Man's known for, mazes. Okay, so now I just need to know where I've gone where I haven't. Okay, I need three for this door. So, strawberries are armor bonuses. Bananas are health bonuses, okay. Let's play through this map and I'll like skip through some of the other maps just to see what they're like. Cause I'm not gonna lie, it's a really interesting concept for a Doom mod, and I played quite a few Doom mods over the years. I'm still not quite sure why someone uh thought to make a Pac-Man mod for Doom. I mean all I'm all for it, you know. Nothing wrong expanding your horizons when it comes to Doom mods. And I have like dozens of Doom mods on my computer. Okay. It'd be pretty cool if the minimap actually plays like that. It has like the actual like Pac-Man color scheme and stuff. And actually shows you all the items are. Yeah, definitely been uh having a pretty pretty decent week, kinda slow at work. You know, with graduations going on. As I mentioned earlier, I went to my nephew's graduation yesterday. Definitely had a good time. Though funny story, um my nephew wanted Rudy's a little barbecue, and uh it was like almost around eight o'clock by the time the ceremony was uh or at least when uh Usually when it comes to graduations, whenever we go to graduation, we leave as soon as our, the uh, person we're attending the graduation with gets their diploma and stuff, then we head out. So it was a little around 8 o'clock. The actual ceremony didn't end until like, much later. But yeah, this is a funny story. So, he wanted Rudy's, and it was around 8 o'clock we got off, but... Uh, we found they closed at 9, which was weird. My dad thought they closed at 11. Or 10, at least. 
because we only have nine dots. So, uh, we were actually hauling ass to Rudy's, and we just barely got under the wire. We got there just minutes before they were about to close, and there was still a pretty decent amount of people in there already. And, uh, we got in there and made the huge order, and we were good to go. We just barely got there. Okay, I'm trying to find one more pack dot so I can... So this is one thing about... Again, I mentioned this before. This is one of the pet peeves I have with Doom mazes. I mean, I did the give all command. So I might as well just do it this way. Well, it gives you all the items, but it doesn't give you all the pack dots. Oh, they're not going to make it that easy for you. You still got to explore the map to get out of it. Cool switch, by the way. Oh. So. <laughs> yeah, we got Rudy's and definitely worth it. I need 16 dots for this. I'm not gonna lie, interesting concept here. You had to collect a certain number of dots to open certain doors. I guess it's mainly just get extra items and stuff. Where's that 10 dot door? So I walked by it several times. Is that. This is an infinity? Oh, this is an infinity. That, okay. Very interesting. I'm not sure if that's a glitch or not. Yeah, that little Rudy situation aside. Yes, it was pretty good. Mr. Okay, so we're getting... Honestly, if you take the pack dots and stuff out of the equation, you're mistaken this for like... Legitimate Doom maps. But I'm curious what the actual, like, where the actual, like, uh... List... List maps. Okay, so we have from here... Okay, we have... Ten regular maps, and starting map eleven is back to normal Doom two maps. But uh, map thirty one is a test chamber. Map thirty two, okay. Let's go check those maps out. Test chamber. Okay. Am I playing Pac Man or am I playing Portal? These are the hidden levels. I guess that's such a long, long time. Okay. Okay, we've got meta now. We went from Pac-Man to Portal. Okay, let's just check the other... Okay, we got... Okay, I was expecting a little more like a... Uh, traditional Pac-Man-esque levels, but... What's interesting... They have Doom levels. Well, Pac-Man levels. Okay, this is hard to explain. Okay. Um, Theming-wise, they're like Doom, but you know, progression-wise, they're like Pac-Man, which is kind of interesting. Okay, this is something I was a little more ex expecting a little more of. Yeah, this is the kind of uh, app I was expecting here. The M's Cacodemon. Ah, they can't attack me. I'm pretty sure I grabbed some of these items. That might change. Okay, in the middle, got. Okay, this is. 
This is a bit more I was expecting. <laughs> yeah, this is what I was more expecting for this mod. Like, more maps like this, like you're playing like Pac-Man levels. For some reason I can't punch. Yeah, I don't have any, uh... Oh yeah, I guess a power pellet let you punch. Don't got a cherry? You ain't attacking, buddy. Ow. Yeah, you have a limited attack once you get the cherries. Yeah. <laughs> Again, really into the. This is a little more I was expecting. But we've got some Doom theme levels that show the, uh. You know, the Pac Man, uh. Okay. Why not? Oh, here's another one a little more to my liking. This is kind of what I was expecting. They would look like you're actually in the arcade game. There's a twist of additional monsters, but at least you can fight back. Alright. And, uh, map 9. Okay, we're back to the regular... Well... Quote unquote regular do maps. So, yeah, basically it adds Pac Man elements to Doom, collecting dots to progress to the level, finding a uh, pinky ghosts, collecting power ups, just like uh, an original Pac Man. And. <laughs> A lot of the maps have mazes, so if you don't like mazes, you're probably not going to like this mod. But I do like Pac-Man. Like, who doesn't like Pac-Man? If she doesn't know what Pac-Man is, she's too young for you, bro. Hell, if she doesn't know what Doom is, she's too young for you, bro. If she only knows a newer Doom game, she's way too young for you. <laughs> but anyway, this is Pac-Man Doom. Definitely check it out. Again, I'll have a link to this in the description for this mod, as well as a link to Drugger K's channel. I probably said his name wrong, but he does a lot of Doom videos. Check him out too. No, I actually come across a few of these interesting mods from him. So uh, yeah, definitely check him out. This is Unforgiven Caleb signing out. Y'all have a good day.